What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, welcome back to the channel. Kind of a late upload tonight, deeply apologize for that, but this is a pretty big PSA that I think everyone with an Activision account should know about. So over the past couple of days, there were reportedly a bunch of Activision accounts that were breached and stolen. Then they were posted on a Discord server for everybody to sign in and change their passwords. It's kind of like a big free for all from what I heard. But then tonight, Activision actually responded to a bunch of reports from players who are kind of spreading this information all over Twitter and they said reports suggesting Activision Call of Duty accounts have been compromised are not accurate. We investigated all privacy concerns. As always, we recommend that players take precaution to protect their Activision accounts as well as any online accounts at all times. You will receive emails when major changes are made to your Call of Duty accounts. If you did not make these changes, please be sure to follow the steps provided. Now, there is a deeper story that goes behind this apparent breach of accounts. I don't want to get into all that right now. But the really, really, really weird thing is the guy who was originally talking about this over on his Twitter and, uh, you know, other social media platforms, every single one of those accounts, like his YouTube and Twitter, have since been removed. The Discord server was also taken down too, from what I've heard. And also since this post came out, there has been numerous, numerous replies stating that their accounts were actually breached. So I don't know what the heck is going on. Activision is saying that the accounts were not breached, but they are still investigating the concerns. But I've just seen so many reports from people saying that their accounts were actually stolen. So, I mean, just to be on the safe side, if you haven't signed in over the past couple of days, check to see if you still have access to your account. And if so, definitely change the password to something that is very unique. Um, I'll have a link down below to a page that Activision set up to give you tips and information on how to make your account more secure. Very, very useful information there. I kind of wish that Activision had a two-step verification, but I'm pretty sure that's going to be coming in the near future, though. Hopefully when Black Ops Cold War comes out. But yeah, right now, I think it's a good habit to start changing your passwords frequently just to ensure that your account is more secure until we get 2FA. I'm not trying to get everybody all riled up about this, but I just think you should be aware and know what's happening to some of your fellow community Call of Duty members. I'm sure Activision is going to be doing their best to ensure that everyone's information is kept private and secure. And like you saw in the email I posted earlier, some people are actually able to gain access and recover their accounts, but there's possibly a bunch of others who have not yet had that access yet. So just to reiterate again, check your emails and try signing into Call of Duty to check if your account was possibly breached. Change your password right now just to be on the safe side and take every possible step to make sure that something like this doesn't happen to you. So with that guys, again, I deeply apologize for the late upload. Tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments. Have you had your account breached? And what are your thoughts about Activision's response to this? And yeah, just tell me your overall thoughts, guys. Thanks for watching. Love you all so, so much. Have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.